get your hands off of me. And I swear, if you accidentally kiss me again, I will rip those lips off your face. Kissing you was a mistake. Yeah. What is this? What is this? You're saying one thing, and you're doing something I'm else. I'm not intentionally messing with you. Okay, so what do you call it? I went off my meds for a few days, okay? I skipped a bunch of pills. I wasn't thinking. The whole lack of impulse thing... I was happy, I hugged you, and then, I don't know, I just... I couldn't stop myself. You know, this all sounds like a convenient excuse. It's the truth, all right? Look, I finally found a place where I belong, and after everything Ted has done for me, I, I don't want to screw him over like that. The days of me playing fast and those with pills are over. I... I really don't want Ted to know that I messed yeah, up. No problem. Thanks for keeping me in the loop. Okay, back again. Something happened? No, I'm gonna go. Just have fun. What was that about? I don't know. Teenagers. <sighs> Jack's pretty upset. I guess you forgot to tell him about last yeah, night. Yeah, Jack is upset because you made it sound like a lot more than a business meeting. Well, you'll always wear a sexy dress and bring a bottle of booze to business meetings. I'm not going to let you ruin my relationship with my fiance. Well, why would I want to do that? I don't know. But if Cortland Electronics is such an albatross and you won't let me have it, then let's just figure out a way to sell it the right way. I'll clear my schedule. We will work night and day until we come up with something that is to your satisfaction. Just you and me alone going over the books. It's the only way to find a suitable buyer. It's the only way? Yes, if you want to honor Palmer's memory. You are planning a wedding. You and me working together ain't gonna happen. Wait for a minute. What are you going to do? Chandler's are a bunch of vultures. I have no intention of getting involved with them, tied up in a fight with them, nor of sharing an office with you, nor doing one other thing that's going to keep me in this town for one more minute than I have to be here. And as for you people, prepare a real offer if you want. I have had it with this town and with all the people in it. Drinks are on the house. Let me call the attorneys. Well, how did that happen? I, it was you, JR. You, you didn't let him rattle you. You set a goal and you got what you wanted. I'm really happy for you. Oh. Caleb is about to hand over Cortland Electronics to the Chandlers. Palmer would be appalled. You know what? I don't give a damn about Cortland. Good boy. But I'd like to hear about you and Caleb last night. 